Well, you may know him for his throwdowns in the kitchen. Chef Bobby Flay stopped by one of his Maryland restaurants today. WJZ is live, and Amy Yancey, who got the best assignment of the day, is back with more on the excitement. Amy? Yeah, Denise, sometimes you get to work and you just know it's going to be a good day. Today was that kind of day for me. And some fans waited an hour, some more, just to meet Bobby Flay and get a burger with his stamp of approval. <laughs> The burger, one of the most famous sandwiches, and Bobby Flay, one of the most famous chefs. Two foodie forces coming together in Towson. I want them to think about it three days later. My goal is that they crave this meal. Fans line up to get their cookbook signed from the titan of Tex-Mex himself. Meeting Bobby Flay is on my culinary bucket list. The Bobby's Burger Palace in Towson opened back in July, but this is the first visit from Chef Flay. The fact that we can attract a Bobby Flay here really symbolizes the great redevelopment that's taking place. I think it's, a, it's genius, first of all, because you want to know where, you know, your fan base is. So this is the part where I usually say something really insightful or interesting or fun. Not today. Today, I'm just going to go for it. You don't even understand how good this is. I believe it's Provolone that has the peppers and the onions, and I love it. What does it taste like? Heaven. <laughs> you can actually get them bunless and put them on a salad if you're watching your carbs. Chef Lay says there's a science to making the perfect burger. It's got to be the right ratio of meat to fat. <laughs> Sorry, I bit it. Whatever you pick, don't forget the fries. And Chef Lay has four locations here in Maryland, but he's considering setting up shop in other locations, too, as long as people keep asking and wanting his burgers. Reporting live, Amy NC, WJZ, Eyewitness News. I know you're jealous. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and hungry. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Amy. The county executive challenged Flay to come up with a Towson burger using only Baltimore ingredients, and of course it would include Old Bay. You know, the nice thing would have been if she brought burgers for all, that right, Bob? Nice. Or fries. Where are they? They're yeah. not here. <laughs> she did